Hey my babies, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Raya J and I'm back with another video. Today is Monday, my babies. Um, I'm about to settle down for the night, but let me get the headphones. So yeah, um, I'm about to settle down for the night, but I got to get this content video out the way. I was actually supposed to do it last night, then I didn't do it. I was supposed to do it this morning, didn't do it. So I'm just going to do it right now and get it out the way because I have some things, you know, like on my chest that I need to express and I sort of kind of need some advice. And yeah, I just want to share this little like story with you all. So, oh, the remote is over there. Um, I was gonna turn down the volume, but I'm not getting back up again. So the other night, I was um. It looks like my my little keloid thing is going away. I don't know if it's going away or getting bigger, actually. But it looks so stupid. What y'all think? I watched a few content videos about people who've had the same thing. And um, they said that I have to... I have the saline cleaning spray. So maybe I need to keep doing that. And also it says to use tea tree oil. Heat it up and then put it on your nose. And it'll be gone by the morning. I should have went and bought some today, but I didn't. Anyways, so the other night I was hanging out with a friend. And, you know, we were we were chilling. We was chilling. We was watching a movie, having a drink, eating tacos. And, um, you know, of course, this is not my man. I'm not his girl. You know, it's not like that. We're just cool. And um, I was receiving a few texts on my second phone, so, you know, I was responding, but I'm, like, over here, you know what I mean, because I don't, you know, we got what we got, but you don't need to be all up in my business, you know what I'm saying, so I'm over here to the left, you know, in my phone, and then he receives a text, so he opens the text, but he's not, like, over here like this, like I was over here like this, you feel me? He just turned, opened the, um, it was, he got a text, so he just turned and opened the text, and, um, I can't believe what I saw, to be honest with you. He received, oh my god, oh my god, this is, this is terrible. Nothing like this has ever happened to me before. He received a dick pic. Yes. Yes. Oh my God. This is embarrassing. This is like, it's like, what do I do? You know what I mean? I know I'm going to see him this weekend. So it's like, what do I do? Do I confront him about it? And you know, I'm, I'm very non-judgmental. You know, I'm the most non-judgmental person you would ever meet, you know, if you've ever met me. <laughs> but, um, you know, and if you've ever conversated with me and stuff like that, people know, like, I don't judge people on people's situations and, you know, what they choose to do with their lives and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Because I, I wouldn't want a person to judge me. And that's just that on that. So, but it's like, he's my friend, you know what I mean? And I care about him. And it's like, oh, my God, what do I say? Hey, hon, um, you know, remember last week we were chilling and, you know, you know, I'm very honest with you. You know, we don't lie to each other. I just want us to even be more honest with each other. Um, when you had got that text last week when we were chilling, I seen the text message, you know, and I seen that you received a dick pic. And it was a black big dick. It was a BBC, y'all. And to my knowledge, he's straight. You know what I'm saying? 
and you know, I don't have nothing against the gay community, the gay boys, the 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 tops, the bottoms, the bisexuals, the LGBTQ community. I don't have nothing against y'all. Y'all know that I'm bisexual. You know what I mean? And I, and I I am a person that lives in my truth. You know what I mean? But this is my friend, you know, to my knowledge, I thought that he was, I mean, we've never, I don't, I don't, to my knowledge, we've never had a conversation like, oh, I'm straight, I'm bi, no, you know, everything has just been authentic, you know what I mean, the vibe has always been good and authentic, you know, so for me to see that text, and then he received it, he looked at it, he was like, oh, wow, and then like, I don't think he texted back, and then he like closed the um, you know, went back to went back to his home screen, and then he looked to see if I was looking, but I was looking at the TV. <laughs> oh my god, yo, this is so intense. You know what I mean? Because even if he's bisexual, whatever he is, I just want him to be honest with me. You know? Oh my god, I'm like starting to sweat. That's how crazy I feel. That's how crazy this is, okay? Oh, God. I don't know, y'all. Comment down below if y'all have any advice for me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications so you know when your girl Raya J posts. Um, also, let me know if y'all want to update video. Because I, I think I am going to bring it up like the next time we link up. I think I am going to bring it up and just be honest. Like, hey, I... Oh, excuse me. Hey, I seen your phone. I seen the message that came up on your phone. And, you know, it wasn't like I was like, you know, I wasn't being nosy or anything like that. I think that's just naturally what we do these days, right? We we just look at someone's phone. You know what I mean? I'm pretty sure he probably seen, you know, a few texts or whatever in my phone. You know, when I was texting back my my messages, you know. And again, we're not together, so it's not that deep. But I would like to know the truth. I would like to know, like, hey, um, maybe his best, because he has a like a best friend, a female best friend, and um, you know, maybe his best friend sent it to him and was like, hey, look at this, look at this, this guy that I'm effing with. Look at his his genital. You know what I mean? <laughs> God. Oh my god. You know, or maybe he is bisexual or I don't know. Like when we talk, he just talks about like, you know, he wants to meet that you know that that one that one special woman he hasn't met her. You know, he always talks about ladies. So to my to my knowledge, I just assume that he's straight. You know, and I don't want to oh god. I feel like I'm jumping the gun. You know what I mean? Like, am I being over dramatic, y'all? Am I, or do y'all think that I am? I am thinking very logical. You know? Oh yeah, see me. I don't got on no lip gloss. How you doing? This is my natural lip color. Um, my lips actually used to be way pinker than this. You know, but because I. Went through, y'all know I had went through a period in my life where I used to be a fucking piehead. <laughs> Starting in my teens to like my early twenties, I I smoked Halloween. I used to love weed so much, but y'all know that I don't smoke any more. Okay, um, I don't even smoke black amounts. I can't even remember the last time I smoked a black amount. I don't smoke. You know, y'all know I just drink my wine, have me a drinky drink here or there. I'm going to eat me a snack. I shouldn't, but I am. But anyways, I just wanted to tell y'all that. Like, you can't be gang because, you know. We have sexual intercourse. You know what I mean. So you can't be gay. Are you bisexual? You know what? What is what you got going on, boo? Like, 
like, what? My God. I was craving some chocolate. So when I went to the supermarket this morning, I picked me up these, you know, the zebra cakes. I bought these, and I bought um, Wookie some honey buns, and I bought a lot of fruits. You know, I'm like obsessed with pistachio seeds, so I, I bought that. I brought Wookie some school snacks. I don't know y'all, but just comment down below. Comment down below anything y'all want to comment, you know, regarding this situation. Please don't forget to... Like, comment, and subscribe, and to turn on your post notifications so you know when your girl posts on the channel. Anyways, I'm going to let y'all go. I didn't want to make this all long. You know, I just wanted to express with you all how I'm feeling about, first of all, I just wanted to tell you all what had happened. What had happened was, and then I wanted to express how I feel about everything. So as you can see, I do have like mixed feelings about everything. Like, you know, because then I also put myself in people's shoes about things. Like, you know what I mean? And how I would want someone to come to me about a situation that they may be feeling a ways about, you know? All right, y'all. I'm going to let y'all go. Thank you so much for watching, my babies. I love y'all so much. And I'll see you all in my next video. Peace and love. Bye.